Hello all you animal lovers out there and welcome to Fascinating Animals. My name is Dr. Ray Crisp and today I have a very delicate topic for you. Today I want to show you how to breastfeed a hamster. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just kidding. Where am I? My name is Donnie Ray Crisp and welcome to Illustration Overdose. And today I want to tell you guys uh, why I haven't been uploading any videos recently. Um, what's going on at the moment and what's coming in the future so to all of you who are still subscribed to my channel and haven't left by now thank you very much for not leaving and thank you for being so patient the reason why i haven't been uploading any videos lately or very rarely has to do with a couple of reasons one being that my day-to-day -day job in the last couple of weeks was very stressful and i had a lot of work to do and i also had some client work and yeah so that's the work related stuff Another reason is I was in Italy for about a week for holiday, just relaxing at the beach and recharging my batteries and now I'm fully charged and good to go. So wait, did that guy just say batteries? Did he, does he have batteries? What is that guy, a cyborg? <laughs> no, I'm not, just a human, don't want to burn out. So that's another reason. And the last reason is, um, you hear about the last reason in a couple of weeks. So I'll let you know about that. So one project I've been working on lately uh, is a Pokemon database. I'm designing and coding the website myself and the idea behind the website was, well since I'm drawing all the Pokemon um, and I'm gonna draw them all, why not create a tiny little database where people can um, go to the, to the site and download the images for free and use them in their projects. I mean, I didn't create or invent Pokemon and I'm just copying the original images and drawing them in my style so you know I don't own it so why not share the high quality images with others so they can use them in their projects so but that project is uh, is paused uh, for the moment because uh, because of the uh, reasons uh, mentioned earlier um, another project is um, what's another project Okay, I got it now. I'm so stupid. I'm sorry, but I'm very, very stupid. So the other project that I've been working on is called Taste Overdose and it's a cooking channel and I'm doing that with two buddies. And the idea behind that channel was about a year ago, buddy and me, we wanted some Chig McNuggets. And I said, hey, you know what? Why not? Let's do them ourselves. Can't be that hard, right? And um, so we, looked on YouTube and searched for how to make Chig McNuggets and there are a lot of videos out there but there's one big problem they're taking like whole chicken breasts and cutting them into little pieces and then um, putting them in batter and cornflakes and whatnot and then frying them and you know that might taste good but I want a chicken McNugget you know what I mean I want the I want the size I want the flavor I want the texture I want them to taste and look like a Chick McNugget. That's what I want. You know, there's a reason why they're so good. So, and I wanted to recreate that. And then uh, we went to get about 100 Chick McNuggets. And uh, then we kind of, I don't know, like reverse engineered them. We were cutting them into little pieces and looking at the texture and how the check texture was made and at the batter and what might be in the batter and, and trying it and then, you know, so um, try that for about half a day and then we finally got it. I mean, 98%, 99%. I'm, I'm not lying guys, this is so, here's a picture I took a year ago and <laughs> one is from us and the other one is from McDonald's. I mean, that looks amazing, right? <laughs> so and I thought, you know, why not share that? Why not give, <laughs> let you guys make that, you know, <laughs> why keep it to, to, to myself, yeah. <laughs> so that's coming and um, we're also doing, um, you know, other stuff like cheeseburger, Big Mac, uh, uh, guacamole, holy guacamole, <laughs> uh, stuff like that. So here's a little preview and you can check it out uh, or you have to because it's just, you know, <laughs> I'm talking and you can see the video so okay so now we're back <laughs> um, 
didn't that look amazing? Oh, okay, so that's coming in a couple of weeks or months um, in German and English. How cool is that? Super cool! Okay, and the upcoming project in the future, and this is gonna be amazing, and I. This is gonna be amazing, believe me. It's gonna be amazing. Um, please pause this video in about 10 seconds and then watch this video. Watch it and then come back and then you have to watch it. Please watch it. Did you pause yet? <laughs> pause the video, watch that video, come back. How amazing was that? I mean, did you, did you see that? I, I watched it about 10 times today and I got goosebumps. Like, do you, can you see the, I got goosebumps. I got goosebumps. That trailer or the pre re whatever trailer that was, it's so freaking amazing. Thank you, Marvel, for being so awesome. Thank you, thank you. So after I saw that video, I was so inspired. I just wanted to grab a pen and just draw everything I saw in that video. Like all the characters, not just the superheroes, but the villains as well. It was just, it was just so amazing. And, and then I, you know, started thinking and then I thought, well, why not do like a super mega over project and do a big poster, like a very, very big poster and draw all the, all the, um, all the superheroes, like the Avengers and Guardians of the Galaxy facing in one direction. We danced all night to the best song ever. And on the other poster are gonna be all the villains facing in the other direction. And then if you take these two posters and hang them side by side, you're gonna have this amazing epic face off. So that's, that's uh, part one. Part two is I get uh, asked a lot if I want to do a collab and um, I can't do collab with all of you guys. That's I'm, I'm very very sorry, but um, I don't have that much time. And other thing is that I also have this little featured artist thingy in my intro, and I never had a featured artist. So I took all this input and merged it to this amazing epic idea, and you're gonna love it. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna draw a rough sketch of each poster, and. Um, the, I'm just gonna draw the characters where they're standing in, in which pose and uh, make little notes and then I'm gonna make both templates available for download and you guys can download that and you can pick your character and then you'll let's say we'll, we'll make um, like give us two to three months uh, time because it has to be perfect guys and then you'll send all the artwork back you can draw multiple characters you it doesn't have to be just one you can just you can draw all of them if you want or just three or whatever and um, But we have to ha we have to get all characters and if I see like after two months Oh, we don't have a I don't know, Thanos or, or uh, Iron Man I'll, I'll uh, you know make an update video and say guys we need an Iron Man or Thor or Thanos or whatever and then you guys have to make uh, make uh, yeah, create those characters and um, you have to draw each character on one template or on one sheet so you can't have like multiple characters overlapping or whatever it just has to be one character on one sheet because more things will get complicated so but um yeah and after you send me all the artwork i'm gonna you know sort it and look and look it through and then i'm gonna present all the artwork in a video all of it i mean if i get 400 ent entries Maybe I'll make four videos and show 100 entries per video. I don't care. You know, I wanna, I wanna feature you guys. I wanna show your artwork and uh, and let's say we get one Iron Man. We're gonna use that Iron Man. It doesn't matter how bad it looks. You know, we're gonna use that Iron Man. But let's say we get three Iron Mans. What are we gonna do? Well, I'm gonna present all Iron Mans and then we're gonna we're gonna vote and you guys are gonna vote which Iron Man you wanna see in the poster. And once we're done, I'm gonna take all the images you voted for and merge them together. And then I'm gonna do some fine tuning with colors and effects and stuff like that. And then we'll have two amazing posters. It's gonna be a huge, epic collab featured artist thing. It's gonna be, it's gonna take us half a year, but it's gonna be, it's gonna be worth it. It's gonna be amazing, okay? And um, each 
and every one of you guys. If it's 200 people, 300 people, or just four, I don't know. We're gonna, you'll be part of the poster. Even if, it, even if your artwork didn't make it into the poster, it's gonna be like a little section where all the names are listed. And then we're gonna, I don't know what we're gonna do with the poster. Each and every, we have to, you know, print it and, and maybe you guys pay like $5 or something and then, or you can just download it and print it yourself on your, in your local Photoshop or, I don't know, we'll have to come up with something. I just, maybe we can sell it or, I don't know, but, it, or we're just gonna keep it to ourselves. It's gonna be a unique thing. Um, I don't know what we're gonna do, but uh, I thought this is the perfect idea. You know, it's like a massive collab featured artists project and we can all work together. And that's what I, I wanted to do for a long time. That's why, it's what one of the reasons I made this channel for. And um, yeah, so, I hope you are excited for that as much as I am, and uh, I'll tell you more about it in the next couple of weeks. That's my video for today. It's a short or a longer update, but uh, I, I don't think if, that I've ever talked that, that long in a video. Have I? <laughs> yeah, maybe, yeah, maybe. So, okay, um, that's it for today. Stay tuned, and I'll see you guys soon.